Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Mariah and I am bringing you guys a, jewel a jewelry collection haul for you guys today. I've been recently posting some of my jewelry pieces on TikTok and they've been doing so well and people have been interested so I thought to post a full YouTube video on all the pieces that I have so far in building my collection of pieces with jewelry. So if you cannot tell, I am a gold, gold girl. The only silver jewelry I have is my nose ring which I do plan to switch over to gold. So I'm really a gold, gold girl. I love the vibe of it, the feel, the, the, just the quality of gold jewelry. So those are pretty much all of my pieces are gold. So I'm going to start off by showing you guys each kind of where they're from. I know I probably can't group them as one because there's just, you know, a lot of pieces to show you guys and to fit it in. But I am going to link everything down below for you guys. So I'm going to stop rambling. And before we do, we switch over to showing you guys everything. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Turn on your post notifications. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it. Um, and leave down below kind of where you get your jewelry from and, you know, your pieces of what's favorite for you going into 2023. So we are going to get started. Okay, so we are going to start off with what I kind of have on right now. And then we're going to show you guys the other pieces. So right now I have these hoop earrings. They're from my local um, hair shop. I have to get more because like I said, as you can kind of tell, they are, the gold is fading from them. So they're starting to become silver. So I rarely wear them anymore, but they are part of my jewelry, you know, collection. I know people say cover them in clear nail polish. Um, for me, it's you're getting what you get. Um, I do have a pair of gold ones that I do want from Amazon. They aren't tarnish and all that. So I do plan on ordering those and I will show you guys what those look like. Um, neck wise, I have this four for four piece right here that came from Amazon. Uh, angel numbers. The rings, this one came from a pack from Target. So it came with a black stone, like with white, but this is the one I kind of wear more. It was the one I wanted more, so I had to buy the pack. The M is from Amazon. It's the newest ring that I have purchased from Amazon. This men's gold band is also from Amazon. Um, so I've had this for a couple of years now, and as you can tell, the color is still there. Is still there on the ring so that is that this ring has come came from an Amazon and not an Amazon an Instagram shop I don't know how to pronounce the name but I will leave the name down below in the ring of the shop of where it came from so I have this ring from them um, the watch band for my Apple watch is from Amazon so this is that piece then the other necklace, which is this Buddha. I got this from my shopping mall, the mall out in South Shore with the Brain Tree Mall. I got this from a little stand. It's called the Chain Shop is where this piece came from. So this piece will not be able to be linked, but I'm sure you can find Buddha necklaces, you know, around the way. So I'm going to show you guys kind of what's in this little jewelry tray of mine that I have pieces from. So we're going to start with one of the newest editions, this necklace. I posted about this necklace on TikTok. So this is a teddy bear gold chain. So this is what this is. So this one was the newest one that I got a couple of days ago. I'll fix that because it was down in the thing. So this is where that one this one also comes from the same place the buddha came from the chain shop in south shore plaza mall so this was the other ring i was telling you guys about that came with this set from target um they did come in a pack for each other but like i said i only wanted the pink stone but i thought i'd show you guys what the other stone looked like just in case if you wanted it so i bought a pack of I think four or five rings from Amazon. 
and this is what they've come so i'm going to show you guys one by one so there is this right right here and then there is this bad boy right here and then i'm also going to show closer clips of them for you guys so you guys can kind of see what they look like because i still have the clips that i filmed for a tiktok that i can put into on the side for you guys to see kind of more of what they all look like so then there's this one Ring right here and then this chunky one right here and if you can tell i'm very into chunky rings so i do like them a lot and this right here is an anklet piece that came off of amazon you can probably if your wrist is thick enough to wear it as a bracelet but it is an anklet. one i just haven't put it on yet so I can definitely show you guys. I don't think I was able to get it on. I think my, my ankle is a little bit wider than what the chain is to be able to link it to cook it. But I can try again and show you guys what it looks like. So this is that. Um, every girl has to have her standard birth year. So this right here is mine. It's 1991. So this is my birth year stone or chain, not stone, chain that I have with my year. So like I said, like I said, I do have the 444 four and this one. Um, one of my last two pieces are the standard M. This is the, these are the, like the initial letters that went viral on TikTok. Mine is tarnishing um, at the bottom. So this one doesn't get worn anymore. But this is what it looks like. And like I said, I've had this one for a minute. So if you see on the back, it is changing on the bottom. So I do plan on replacing. I probably, what I'm probably going to do is where I got the Buddha and the bear from is get the initial M just to replace it. Since I already have the chain and the chain is still in good condition, just change this out. But this is, you know, mine. Like I said, I've had it for a year or two. So it's to be expected with the wear and tear because this was literally what I've worn all the time. And then I got this other viral TikTok necklace, the famous sideways letters for initials. Let me unravel this. And it is the M necklace. So this is what this one looks like with the M to it. And it goes like this. So that is all of the jewelry. Nope, oh, there's one more. So I got this dupe bracelet off of amazon as well so this one is mine in the in the black and it does come in multiple different colors so you can choose i think there's like a green a white a red so those are all those you know colors that it does come in. So i did black because it goes with everything so i can still wear it but yeah that is pretty much all of the jewelry that i have and what I have to show you guys for today. So I hope you guys like this little brief, you know, little haul. And if you guys have any questions on any pieces that I have, you know, where they're from, the quality of them, because said pretty much the Amazon jewelry that I have, besides the, the new rings and the M, like the 1991, has been with me for forever. My rings have been, like this ring has been with me for a minute, and so hasn't the watch band. And they've all held up pretty, pretty nicely. So I still have those few, those few newer pieces that, you know, we're still trying out. Haven't had any issues with them yet where like there was a quick tarnish or color coming off. No, none of that. So those are really good pieces. And I love to find good, like affordable staple pieces that aren't, that you can wear for a quality of time, but you know what you're getting into with the tarnishing and the changing of colors. So like with the M necklace, I'm not mad that it's, you know, tarnished. I'm not going to say it's a bad note. It held up for a long, long time because I think I got that necklace in 2021 so like i said it's a year old of a necklace and i got it when i got the 1991 1991 so you can tell i wasn't a lot um showered with it so like i said over time it's you know i've had jewelry where like i've worn it in the shower and then the next day it's like completely gone so like i said i haven't tried out the buddha or the knights or the four for four one in the shower but i just like i said i take my jewelry off when i do shower 
so like i said this one i'm not really mad about what the you know or disappointed in the you know the change of color at the bottom you know it's expected when buying jewelry so that's my little jewelry haul for 2023 i know i probably will be adding more to it so there would definitely probably be a part two to this video and an update for jewelry pieces so if you guys enjoyed and have any questions please leave them down below and i will be sure to answer them as the best as i can you guys have a wonderful day and i will see you guys in my next video on your backstage pass all access this is mad we can go wherever with that ass no to the shower to the tub truck to the club for the party you go in first with your girls because i don't know who's out there watching but i do know one thing though women they come they go saturday through sunday monday monday sunday yo baby i love you one day maybe we'll someday grow till then i'll sit my drunk ass on that runway on this one way Ooh.